I would think this is awesome. I also like like the green color, and we have seen this color when, when I show you the plasma generated in the bulbs, in the glass tubes, and when we had Xenon, this was the color. You just touch it, there you have it. By the way, it consumes less power when the, it's not in the middle of the fre resonating frequency and you have this ring, and when you increase it, I can see how the fan is starting to ramp up and also the bulb is getting quite hot. Actually, after, after two or three minutes, you can't even touch it. I mean, you can touch it, but just for a few seconds. Look at that. So awesome. I wonder if I could push it just below the level of the coils. Okay, this is just a simple test. I have a, a magnet here. Let me just turn it on and create a ring. And see what happens when I get close with the magnet. It looks like it bends just a little bit towards the magnet. Let me just use more magnets. Yeah, it moves. Yeah, I can move the ring. Can you see it? I can like confine it, maybe using multiple magnets. Yeah. Just as in a reactor, they confine the plasma using magnetic fields, right? Or am I wrong? You want to see something even crazier? I was making tests with some other gases. This is Krypton. So as you can see, look, it creates some sort of helix inside. Not sure if you can see it on the camera. Disappear there. Ui! Look at that. Can you see it? It has the shape of a helix. The reason for the torrid shape is that xenon can easily produce 